Infertility affects 30% of women and 40% of men in South Africa. Navigating infertility can be a complex and often stressful journey due to the high costs normally required for treatment. The Tigerberg Fertility Clinic is dedicated to helping anyone struggling with fertility to achieve their dreams of having a family at an affordable cost with a team of competent and compassionate professionals there to assist on each step of the journey. Services we offer include intrauterine insemination, in vitro fertilization, intracytoplasmic sperm injection, and routine semen analyses. The fertilization procedure is largely dependent on the sperm parameters observed during a routine semen analysis. The macroscopic parameters observed are the color, volume, viscosity, and pH. The microscopic parameters observed are the sperm count, motility, morphology, and the antibody test. Semen analyses are performed not only on our fertility patients, but may be arranged for anyone seeking to test their sperm. Semen analyses are often neglected when deciding upon treatment, as male factor may account for 50% of infertility in a couple. After consultation, the IVF journey begins with the administration of medication, leading to the simulation of the development of multiple follicles in the ovary. The follicles are aspirated during the oocyte aspiration and are collected in tubes. The embryologist will examine the follicular fluid aspirated to separate the oocytes from the follicular fluid. Following the oocyte aspiration, the semen sample used will need to be prepared prior to fertilization. The oocytes retrieved will either be fertilized by conventional IVF or by intracytoplasmic sperm injection, also known as ICSI. Dependent on the previously determined sperm parameters, the sperm will either be prepared by an embryologist via the swimmer preparation method or by the density gradient preparation method. Sperm preparation is essential as it removes cell debris and dead immotile sperm, allowing the base sperm to be retrieved for fertilization. Prepared sperm can be used for IOI, IVF or ICSI. The two fertilization methods performed at the clinic are conventional IVF and ICSI. Conventional IVF entails placing the oocytes in a four-well dish and then adding the prepared sperm to the dish. It relies on the sperm's ability to penetrate the oocyte without additional assistance. ICSI entails the selection and in injection of a single sperm into the cytoplasm of the oocyte. ICSI bypasses the natural fertilization process, therefore is used in cases of severe male factor infertility. Upon fertilization, the embryo's development is monitored over the following five days. According to a criteria, the embryo's development is graded and the embryologist will select the best embryo for, for transfer. The embryo transfer may either occur on day 3, day 4 or day 5. Any remaining embryos will be frozen with consent.
It is important for gynecologists and general practitioners to understand the importance of a full fertility workup on the presenting couple. Factors such as age, sperm, anti-malarian hormone levels and follicle stimulating hormone levels are important diagnostic tests to perform when assessing fertility and deciding upon treatment. Our team has dedicated their life's work to offer cost-effective treatment for all South Africans. The team takes great pride in every procedure and we hope this video helps you understand the care we put forth in helping patients achieve their dreams. Thank you.